That's the way in the bed in case this go left. Not to be used on eyebrows and eyelashes, girl. Cause who would? I'm sure. We're gonna apply it and see what happens. Oh. Okay, I think I got it. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Tootie if you're new here and I'm honey. Today, <laughs> we're about to tackle this hair. It's time for me to clean my locks, but I wanna do something different. I wanna switch it up. I'm a little bored with my hair, so I, wanna, I just wanted something kind of fallish. But then I was like, I, I don't wanna go too drastic. If I don't like the way this goes, a tilt fade is the, or I might get a boosty fade, I don't know. If you're interested in seeing me potentially fail at life and end up bald headed, <laughs> Then keep on watching because baby <laughs> i don't know how this is gonna go i've never done this before we're about to see what happens when i dye my hair i don't know what color necessarily i want to go with i got a few different colors i got one two three i have four different colors i know for a fact i want my roots to be darker than the rest of my hair yeah i'm a little nervous if i don't like it i can just dye it another color or chop it off i did go to the beauty supply store the other day and y'all this is how much y'all know what I'm doing. I asked the man, I said, excuse me, sir. What do I need to use to dye my locks? And he said, I'll <laughs> ask her because I, I don't know. He pointed me in the direction of the closest black woman that worked there. Shots out to her. She was so sweet. And she was like, sis, you're going to need to lift these. She said, I needed these two things. You put these together so that way your hair can be bleached. And I was like, ooh, we got to bleach it because I, I won't prepare for that still. Mm -mm. I wasn't planning on bleaching it. I just thought I could put the color on here and it was going to do what it was going to do. She said, nah, fam. If you have black hair like me and you want it, your color to really pop, you're going you're gonna to need to bleach. Probably. Yeah, that's, that's what they say. My disclaimer, I'm not a professional. I don't do hair for a living. And with nobody cosmetology school, we're going to try it without it. I also got a brush. <laughs> Cute. Some little scrunchies. This ain't got nothing to do with that, but child, I got them from the hair store. I use the Mango Lime Tingle Shampoo to shampoo my hair. And y'all, this is the best stuff ever. Prima Nature Argan Oil Edition Apple Cider Vinegar. This right here. Baby, if you got locks, get you some of this. Even if you don't have locks, I guess. Yeah. It works amazing. I also got neck strips. I, I don't know why I got these. Wow. What a moment. Why did I get these? I guess I... Mm. I don't know, y'all. We'll figure it out. I realized when I got home, I had nothing to mix the stuff with. So, I went in the kitchen and got these cups. So, we're going to see. I got this petroleum jelly. Y'all nasty. But, y'all, I got this because they said, wait a minute. Y'all hope this don't burn. Oh, my God. Lord, please, please, please. You know my heart. Please don't let this burn. I'm a good person, please. Um, Yeah, I'm scared. That's why I don't get relaxes because I don't want it to burn like a perm. Oh no, I hope this helps. I hope this does what it's supposed to do. It says skin protecting, so hopefully it protects everything that I needed to protect. Um, I got some gloves. I got the conditioning thing, because they say this, the heat from your body is supposed to activate the situation. So, hold on, can y'all see? Okay, good. It's time to get into the color. These are the colors that I was interested in. Hmm. What color y'all think I went with? Hmm. I love all of these. So these were all potential candidates, but I also took into account that I need a color that's going to go with my skin tone. I picked more than one. Comment down below. Let me know what colors y'all think I chose. Go ahead real quick, real quick, real quick, real quick. So the first color I chose was cinnamon. Yeah. Come on, cinnamon. Y'all, I have no clue how this is going to look in my head. The next color is spiced amber. And I also went with a completely different uh, situation because baby, like I said, I didn't know what I was doing. So we're going to see. And then I have paprika. Oh, I don't know about paprika, chair. Hmm. Wow, what a moment. It's giving Victoria's Secret bottle for me. Yeah. Oh, no. I don't know because the Victoria's Secret bottle look kind of good on my head. Okay, come on, somebody. Yeah, okay, great. So we got paprika. And then we went ahead and went with Cajun Spice. Hmm. Shouts out to my girl, Naturally Sunny. She ain't really my girl. She don't know me in real life at all. But she inspired me to color my hair. Ever, comma. She 56 shades lighter than me. So, uh, yeah. so I don't think that that's going to look cute on me. I feel like if, if I go with this for the roots, and then I come in with this on the tips, y'all just imagine. Oh, no, that's giving cornucopia. It's giving very much Thanksgiving. Hmm. I don't know. It might, it might. Hold on. Or maybe this, this at the top. Either way it go, this is going to the top. And then this to the bottom. Oh. Okay. Okay. 
okay, probably not it because it's doing a little too much. Yeah, okay, okay, that's what we're doing. All right, I'm gonna skip the bleaching step. We're gonna try to do it without bleach because I'm doing this by myself and I can't really see the back of my head all that great. Coming to club, shaking my dress, throwing any bowl, busting any head. Let's go hop in the shower. Well, I'm hopping in the shower. I can't bring out with me because that would get my channel deleted probably. Um, and I'll be back. Hmm. I'm back, y'all. Freshly washed hair. Oh, it smells so good. It's time to get to it. I got my little conditioning cap. I probably should go ahead and open this stuff. Use it. And I see people uh, doubling up. I'm probably going to use three because, baby, I have a big head. Um, I wonder should I use the same... I thought she got three brushes, huh? Wow, what a moment. Oh, God, it's good. Two came in a pack. Okay, very good. I'm gonna just follow the instructions, which are shampoo and towel dry. That's the first step. That's what we're about to do. And then use a protective cream. Your petroleum jelly. And then it says, uh, apply hair color one eighth from the sky. One eighth. Y'all. Every single day, my math teacher proves that I should have paid attention in class. Hmm. Every single day, realize the importance of math. I'm going to go get a ruler, and we're going to figure out what one eighth is, okay? Um, hmm. Dang. I'm assuming that's a little bit from the scalp. A little, wait, a little bit from the scalp. <sighs> Let me call my auntie real quick to figure out what one eighth is from my scalp. And then, um, y'all know me in math. Who chill? Calm through thoroughly. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to calm through. Cover with a plastic cap and process with heat for up to 50. I'm going to use my body heat. <laughs> I know people sit on the dryer. We're going to use my body heat and see what happens. Oh, child. Um, so I was going to try to record the process of me doing it, but it was very time consuming. Um, The cups, that was a dud. We took this with my gloved hand, squirted it in my hand. Cause the brush, no go. And, and then I just covered the length of each lock with this stuff. Um, I didn't quite figure out what one eighth was. So I went up to my scalp like by this much. And then when I got to the front, I completely forgot about the one eighth rule. And I went all the way to the scalp. So it's burning a little bit. Oh no. Oh, y'all might can see the color. I'm excited. Let's take these off real quick. As y'all can see, that's the color I went with. Oh, I hope it's bright. Okay. I know you fucking lying. <sighs> Bruh. It's a little bit of color. I wanted my whole head to be giving little mermaid tees. Like, <sighs> it's literally just a tee. It's more on my hands than on anything. I'm just upset. Like, I literally only dyed my daggone scalp. I just used the bucket that it came in. I just put six level scoops of this. Let's mix this. Five blue ounces. <coughs> this stuff's strong. Wear a mask. Oh, cups. 30 milliliters is how many ounces for oh, one second. Oh, I'm gonna do five of these because 30 milliliters in here. Oh, I'm gonna go to jail. You wanna see? I really am feeling that life, so I don't mix the stuff up. Then decided to delete the rest of the instructions that say, do not shampoo immediately before bleaching. That's what I did, because I just rinsed out the rest of the stuff. Word. But it's okay, here what we're gonna do. I'm gonna just do the ends of my hair. Yep, we're gonna do the tips. We're gonna see what happens. All right, it's not even say how to leave, how long to leave it on for. Mm. Wow, what a moment. Wait, was I supposed to mix? Okay, well, I done mixed it together, but I think it's ready. Wait, do I put the dye in now? We just go, we gonna apply and see what happens. Oh God, I'm so nervous. Okay, let's do it in the bed case this go left. Two, two of the tips coming. Oh, I'm going too far up. Oh no. Get the fan on because I legit feel like I'm about to pass out. Whew, it's giving future Hendrix. Put some blind in my dress. I went 
I had no clue to go to bed this bed and I, I legit feel like I'm about to vomit. Who y'all I'm back. Let's try this again and pray I have hair. Hopefully the tips have some color. Okay. I love this for me. Yes, ma'am. I might not even add nothing extra to them because I really like this color. Now, it's not the most even type of application, but I don't mind it. Yeah, I'm going to add a little bit more. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Hmm. I think we should go a little more vibrant. Let's try it. BRB. Y'all, I really like this. I wish it were even, which is why I'm going to go over it with the new color. Ooh. Oh, she still got bleach in there. Come out of there, bleach. Wow, what a moment. See? Oh, man. Let's see what DJ thinks. Yeah, we're going to go rinse it. Oh, look good. You like it? Yes, ma'am. Okay, all right. I'm going to add in some more color to it. Y'all, look at it. Love the color. Look at the color. Get into it. Now we're about to just twist it up. I love it. I love it, love it, love it, love it. All right, so let's start with this retwist, which is going to be a bit challenging for the simple fact I didn't cut all my hair in different lengths. But look, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. I guess, I guess, yeah. So I'm not with nobody, because I don't want to hurt nobody. Did it over text, didn't call me. So it's all done. I just did some rope twists to use the color on this one, but yeah. I put some rubber bands on it, and then tomorrow I'll take it loose. I might, I don't know. Or I might just leave it like this, pin it up. I can't do it right now because it's a little tight. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Or I could even go this way with it. And... Which is what I think I'm going to do. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I am pretty much done. That is it. I usually do a bust down middle part, but I just pulled it to the side so y'all can see. Um, I absolutely love the color and hopefully it'll be a little bit brighter or more vibrant once it dries. Um, of course, I didn't want it too bright, which is why I added the paprika color over top of the copperish type color. But I do love it. I think it's really cute. And hey, we had a little setback. It didn't go exactly the way I wanted it to go, but I still think I did okay for it to be my first time. But yeah, I love this. Y'all let me know in the comments down below what y'all think, how I did, how you girl did. Let me know. Shout out to my boy, Quad Godspeed. I'll link his channel down below if he even started it, child. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And until next time, meet me somewhere in the comments. I'll